Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to the vlog. Today is Friday, August the 20th. I'm actually picking up from last week's vlog. Friday's vlog is still Friday, and we're out in the car. We just left. Josh just got home from pressure washing not too long ago. It's 2.30. He came by to get his hair cut real quick. I got mine trimmed earlier. Um, but he's getting his hair cut, and then I have to go to Belk and return those pants since I didn't do that yesterday. I think we have a whole lot going on today. Friday's always, the girls get to stay up later, though, so they'll get to stay up and do movie night tonight yeah right now we're just pretty much stopping to get his hair cut and return those pants to belk i do need to exchange one of those pair of pants so for ally a pair of khakis for school tuesday next day it is saturday we have already had breakfast it's still saturday morning josh is outside cutting grass some of the girls are drawing some are outside so while they are doing that emily's holding millie for me i am cleaning out our homeschool cabinet over here this thing has been sitting like a mess all summer long and here's the mess that's coming out of it i have been working on it for probably about 15 minutes or so i am getting things out of the cabinet taking extra books upstairs that I'm not going to be using, throwing away things that are used and old, and giving away a few things. So that's what I'm working on this morning. I've been wanting to do this all summer, but I was pregnant and tired, didn't feel like it, and then I had Millie, and of course I didn't want to then either. So today's the day because we're going to start back lightly on school this coming week. Still waiting on our curriculum to come in. I'm excited to show y'all what that is for my third grader, first grader, and kindergartner. Once it comes in, it's, it's on back order, so it's going to be here. I think September the the first week of September, I think. Um, but we're still going to start this week lightly, and then my older girls start um, their school on Tuesday, which they will be going Tuesdays and Thursdays. So, getting this cleaned out, getting it organized, and I'll show y'all what it looks like when I'm finished. Okay, so it's done. I've actually been done for a while, but I had to go upstairs and get ready. There it is. So, these two cubbies up here on the left is just laptop chargers, phone chargers. Couple of my camera accessories, things like that. Um, this little wooden box here is just full of pens and pencils. I actually got this from Target at the beginning of the summer. This right here has loose leaf notebook paper, um, envelopes, just some flashcards, some miscellaneous things in that one. This one here, I put all of the little kids' readers in here. Um, their Amelia Bedelia books, just some of their favorite little readers are in here with some flashcards. These are Kylie's books that she will be reading through um, in the 10th grade at her school. So she has those there. And this is Musical Multiplication that I ordered from The Good and the Beautiful. I've never used this before. You can tell it's brand new. But I'm excited to try it out this year. This is just a lot of um, like preschool books and notepads, sketch pads, things like that. That I just have stacked here along with my computer paper in case I need any more that's natalie's box and then i have two empty shelves and i wanted to keep these empty because um i have some curriculum coming in and it's gonna have a lot of readers with it so i need shelf space for their readers so i'm probably i may organize this a little bit differently once it does get here but it was a total mess and i'm glad it's cleaned out this cubby beside it i need to do something with it as well and i've got my printer sitting on the top there um it was upstairs but i had to bring it down because i do so much printing it's just more convenient to have it here with me so that's that but like i said i have been wanting to tackle that all summer long and just have not felt like it it's saturday i figure today is the day so i got that done i'm thankful i got it done i'm excited for their curriculum to come in so that i can get it all organized and put together in there um and we'll be set to go we'll be ready to go for school even though we're going to start lightly this week we'll be ready for like our um, complete curriculum once it gets here miss mealy's waking up hey mealy did you have a good nap did you have a good nap? But anyway, I told y'all on last week's vlog that I would show you some of the fall stuff that I put out that I brought out of storage and got sat around. I don't know if I'll keep it like this and I may add one or two pieces here and there um, as we do get into fall, but I'm just gonna show you what I have put out right now. So this is over here on my counter, like looking from the living room into the kitchen. I just had my pumpkin candle here that I got from Walmart. And this, 
says harvest season super cute i've had that for a long time i don't remember where i got it i want to say hobby Lobby because that's where most of my stuff comes from um, along with a little cute plaid little soft pumpkins i've got two on each side there and then beside that counter over here is like our mantle and our tv and all of that so on my mantle i think i've already showed y'all my burlap um with a little piece in the middle that says autumn leaves and pumpkins please so i've got that there and then my little scarecrows i found at my storage box so i set one on each side and then below that is just one of my pumpkins i've had forever y'all this fall thing i've had even longer i've had it for many years i think they don't even have the orange i don't even think they have the orange one at hobby lobby anymore i think it's a white and black instead of orange and black i think i saw white and black there and then over here is our homeschool cabinet that we've had set up for a while um, and on top of that is just our charlie brown he comes out every single year we've had him for many years i want to say like 10 years we've had charlie brown and he comes out and sets out somewhere and he actually plays music let me see if i can get him to do it there he is he says happy thanksgiving and he does a little charlie brown tune you could probably tell his batteries are going dead but he's super cute and he's going to sit up there on our school cabinet this year and then over here against my steps where little miss millie's sleeping this table all i have here literally is just this little plaid pumpkin with a little white pumpkin that says fall sweet fall i may end up putting a candle there or one more piece but that's all i have there right now and that is also like right there as you walk in our front door and look it matches our glider <laughs> and then my kitchen table which y'all have seen many many times i just have this here again this is very old stuff that i've had it's just this little flower arrangement that has the fall colors this says give thanks to the lord and then this little wooden pumpkin so those little three pieces are all i have on my dining room table and these maps that i've had hung up um since last year a lot of y'all ask questions about it and i actually order these maps off of amazon if i can find them i will link them so i got the u.s map and the world map off amazon and then my husband josh he just framed them for me so he just made the frames he cut it out he stained it and then hung it up there and it just turned out beautiful um so that is where the maps come from and then he made the frames all right and the last few fall pieces are in my kitchen so i've had this for a while it's one of those little glass jars that you could put like one little um tea candles in there so i've got that sitting there beside my sink and then on my window right above my kitchen sink is the little piece that says hello fall i just got that this year from hobby lobby it's super cute and then beside my coffee maker is this little morning pumpkin which i just got this year as well so that is the fall pieces that i have oh and then the kitchen i have my rug which i need to vacuum um i got this last year it says give thanks and i got that from hobby lobby i'm not sure if they have new ones out or if they still have this one but yeah that's pretty much it all right so now it's two and josh has to go somewhere for work real quick so we're just gonna ride with him we have nothing else to really do anyway so we're gonna ride with him and we're gonna be passing through the town that has dunkin donuts and guess what y'all they have their pumpkin spice uh, lattes in their pumpkin spice like iced drinks and their pumpkin spice donuts or at least i think they have their donuts i do know they have their pumpkin coffees at least i don't know about their donuts but i think they have their donuts so we're going to stop by there i'm going to get me a pumpkin drink and then i told the girls that we would get them some donuts so hopefully they're pumpkin donuts if not we'll just get them the sorted but that's where we're going now So we're back home now they actually did have the pumpkin spice latte so that's what i got i got cold and then um josh actually wanted one but he got the hot one he said it was better than starbucks to him but anyway we're back home now but they were all sold out of the pumpkin spice donuts they had them but they were sold out so we just got this sorted for the girls but they don't get that until after dinner and i just came straight home i put the green beans on there over there and we'll have baked potatoes green beans and then grilled chicken just got little miss millie all changed and fed she's got the hiccups now are you had the hiccups starting? Hmm? Say, so I have the hiccups. <laughs> now I'm just gonna sit here with Millie for a little while while some of that is cooking because it's only like four o'clock, I think. It might be like right at four. We won't eat until 5.30 or six and then it will be time to start our routine for Saturday night. Tomorrow is our first day back to church. Um, well, mine, mine and Millie's first time back to church since she's been born. So we got a lot to get done tonight. I've already picked out everybody's dress for in the morning. That's laid out. Um, shoes are pretty much done, laid out. Everybody just got to get baths after dinner and all of that stuff. I figured I would go ahead and end this vlog here. I thank y'all so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, I would love if you hit that subscribe button down below. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll talk to you in the comments. Bye.